Now this is more me, remote, isolated and pretty much deserted. No one's going to find me here. Where are they? So I'm starting to wonder why there's no one else parked up in this really beautiful spot. Well, it would appear that I've parked in a floodplain. Luckily, I've got a bit of bank that I've driven up. And I've just looked up the tide times. And this is high tide, 11.46. But it's nice and pretty. <sighs> Seeing as I'm in a lake. So, here's some good advice. When all the other cars disappear and you think, that's a bit odd, this is a pretty place. There's a reason. I'm now parked in a lake but I've got a good six inches spare before I'm flooded van life eh so after night's after last night's I'm not even awake yet so after last night's flood I've come out to try and catch the moon on this old ruin of a house and also get something with the sun coming up over the power station and entitle it solar versus coal but I'm waiting for the light to do its thing skies are amazing so that's the idea this beach and the car park flooded last night and if there was any footage I managed to get it was lapping on the car and the carriage it's an amazing place but I was panicking there for a minute there was a girl parked in the uh, car next door to me <laughs> she was going what's going on the skies are amazing they're turning pink now it's 6.47 so I've, the sunrise has come and gone from there but hopefully I've uh, got a few shots of it I'm travelling down through mid Wales to uh, meet up with some people and this is what I found. Wow! What a place! This is absolutely amazing. I don't know the exact location because I've just been following the sat nav. I'll put it here so you can come and visit. I mean, this is just awesome. Absolutely gorgeous. So I'm gonna just stop with my camera and a coffee for a few minutes and uh, see if I can capture some images. I might even try and do a pano because that is just spectacular. Wow. Mid Wales. I wasn't gonna come this way. I was gonna go down the main, the main route back to where I've got to get to as a temporary stop as a respite 
but I'm glad I came this way. The windy roads, the whole route has been fantastic actually. Coming down from the highest pass in North Wales, which is this, to this. And the sat nav just took me this way. Windy roads, hills, valleys. Do you know what? I'm falling in love with Wales. I genuinely am. When I first arrived here, it smelt of piss and looked like really dishevelled, a bit like me in the morning. But as I've travelled through it, I've really started to fall in love with it. It's beautiful. It's a beautiful country. So much variety. Wow. You can tell that I am just awestruck by it. Just absolutely phenomenally in love with Wales. I'd say something in Welsh now, but I don't know anything apart from Arath, which is slow, which is a good idea. I should slow down and see more of this. Unfortunately, this is the route for me out of Wales. I'm going to the Peak District next, and then on up through to another country, Scotland. So it's going to be hard to leave Wales. It was hard to leave Cornwall. It's harder to leave Wales. So I can't imagine it gets any better than this. So I'll use this opportunity to say thank you for watching. Really appreciate it. If you uh, haven't subscribed already, um, it'd be really, really great. And I'd be most grateful if you consider subscribing. It really helps the channel and ringing the notification bell for uh, notifications, obviously, of any other videos of my travels around the UK um, for the hashtag Nifty UK Tour find that one image the hashtag 50 image that i've been hunting for so this is beautiful wales i'll say goodbye thanks for watching uh, catch me next time i'll be heading to the peak district and then on up the country into a new country scotland so uh, that is something i'm really looking forward to and it should be something special with a bit of luck with a bit of mist and views better than this i can't imagine it but Every time I stop, there's something better comes along. Thanks for watching. Take it easy. Drive safely if you're coming to places like this. The roads are windy. And I'll catch you next time on 50andnifty.com. Cheers. Take it easy. Bye.